Simple science. What is the cardiovascular system? Your cardiovascular system is made up of your heart and blood vessels, your arteries, veins, and capillaries. The heart pumps blood under pressure out through your arteries, and blood drains back under lower pressure to the heart through your veins. The purpose of this is to deliver oxygen and nutrients in the blood to the tissues in every part of the body, and carry away carbon dioxide and other waste products. The reason the heart can pump blood is that it is hollow, with walls made of powerful elastic muscle, which can contract, squeezing the blood inside out through connected hollow tubes, which are the arteries. The heart has four chambers or cavities inside it. Dark red, oxygen-depleted blood from the body enters the upper right chamber of the heart, or right atrium, through two large veins, called the superior vena cava and inferior vena cava. This deoxygenated blood passes into the right ventricle, whose walls contract. Pumping it out through the pulmonary artery to the lungs, where hemoglobin in the blood picks up oxygen. The bright red oxygenated blood from the lungs returns to the heart through the pulmonary veins, entering the upper left chamber of the heart, called the left atrium. This blood passes into the left ventricle. Whose powerful muscular contractions squeeze it out through an artery called the aorta. The heart has valves which can close to prevent blood from flowing backwards as the walls of the heart contract and relax, and this is what gives rise to the distinctive lub dub sound of the beating heart. The aorta divides into smaller arteries. And then into arterioles, which carry the oxygen-rich blood to the different parts of the body. The inner surface of an artery is smooth, allowing the blood to flow quickly, and its outer walls are strong and elastic to cope with the pressure of the blood inside. Arterioles branch out into a network of very fine capillaries. Through which the blood continues to flow, delivering oxygen and nutrients to the tissues. Oxygen and nutrients are exchanged for carbon dioxide and other waste products, which the blood now carries away from the tissues, draining back under low pressure through thinner-walled veins to the heart, to begin the whole process again.